the ideas of audience and purpose start to give us an idea of why writing is important. But I asked Professor Kotos to tell us why she thinks that writing is so important for English learners. She said that writing actually helps students to learn English. Why do you think it's important to teach writing to students? Writing is often overlooked in EFL teaching and learning, as was the case in my English learning experience. I think my English teachers may have shied away from teaching writing not only because of its many complicated rules and structures, but also because they were not familiar with different types of texts and different types of audiences. However, I strongly believe that teaching students to write well is very important. Overall, writing helps students learn the English language better. You may ask how? Well, writing allows students to apply and consolidate the vocabulary and grammatical forms that they are learning in class and from their textbooks. That means that writing allows students to actually translate passive knowledge of language structures to active use. Writing also allows students to go back and see what they produced on paper or a computer screen. It allows them to self-analyze, self-assess, and detect the language problems or language misuse that they need to be working on. Plus, writing can be considered a stress-free way to practice language. Another reason why teaching writing is important is because writing is increasingly used in a wide variety of situations outside of the classroom. We live in an age of globalization, where English has become the language of international communication. With advanced technologies, for example, everyone engages in written communication more than ever before. People of all ages are text messaging, posting on social media, blogging, and commenting on various types of online posts. So writing skills are key to participating in the English-speaking world. In a sense, writing also keeps communication mobile and fun with all these devices. Of course, different modes of communication employ different writing styles, different language choices, and different levels of formality. But for many people, Writing is also an opportunity to express agency and identity and show who they are and what they believe in. Thinking of more formal contexts like business, education, and employment, writing ability is really high stakes because well-written documents are often a person's way to demonstrate professional expertise. Oftentimes, students' writing is the only way to assess their content knowledge or their academic potential and performance. A poorly written resume, on the other hand, will never land anybody their desired job. So teaching writing has long-term benefits because writing skills will be useful to students in a wide variety of situations outside of the classroom. Professor Kotos emphasized that writing allows students to use their knowledge of grammar and vocabulary. When students write, they get practice combining their language knowledge in new ways to convey meaning. Students can also observe, analyze, and assess their language knowledge by looking at what they have written. Writing is used for many forms of communication inside and outside the classroom. Everyone engages in written communication. They text message, post on social media, blog, comment, and email. Written communication is fun and social. But more than just fun, writing is really important because it's a way of expressing identity. By identity, we mean expressing who we are. Identity is not just what we look like, what nationality we are, or what language we speak. It is also how we use the language. It's what we say. It's the words that we choose. It's all of the ways that we use language. Language helps to create who we are, so students need to learn how important their language choices are.